So this is my very first vlog and I'm very awkward talking to the camera. It is really weird and uncomfortable and I just want to try and get used to it. So here's a test. I'm going to show you my day. It's going to be a little bit boring in the beginning because I'm going to be doing a lot of cleaning around my house and then in the afternoon it's going to be really fun because I'm going to a kind of Thanksgiving-esque party. We are all cooking a dish. I'm making green bean casserole and we're bringing it over to my friend Heather's house. So that will be a little bit later on today. And then at the end of the day, I'm going to a bonfire with some of my other friends. We are gonna be burning my Christmas tree, which is kind of sad, but also awesome. And we're gonna be burning a bunch of other wood. Um, and it's gonna be really fun. So we'll just see how this goes. First stop today, I'm making a smoothie. Smoothie time. So, watch me make a smoothie. have now showered and my hair and makeup and now it is time to film a video on king cakes. I am going to make king cake for the very first time in my life and I'm a little bit nervous because it seems kind of complicated but we'll see how it goes. Alright, baking is kind of, no, baking isn't done. Prep work is done. <laughs> um, so I made the um, King cake is here and it needs to rise for an hour and a half. Um, I have about probably uh, 50 minutes left on this um, to rise. Then over here I made the icings and the filling and I'm also going to add apple pie filling to this so it's like apple-y and um, cream cheesy. Um, I actually tried this frosting with the recipe and it has a lot of lemon in it and it tastes disgusting but I'm hoping that with it mixed with everything else, it will taste a little bit better because right now it kind of sucks. So we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Um, right now I'm about to head um, to the store. I need to go to Michael's, Office Depot, and PetSmart. And then I have to rush back here and get this dough set. Then let it lets it sit for 30 minutes and then during that time, I'm going to whip together my um, green bean casserole for my party, and then I have to fly to the party. Oh no, then I have to bake the thing, the king cake, and then I have to fly to the party. Oh my gosh, busy day. <laughs> but uh, hopefully I have enough time to get everything done. Fingers crossed. I'll see you at Michael's. So I just finished up at Michael's, and I was going to film in there, but I don't know, it was kind of awkward. Michael's is so quiet. So it's really weird to like just pull out a camera and be like, hey, this is what I'm buying. Also, I've seen on other people's vlogs that they get in trouble when they film inside stores. So, I don't know. I didn't film in there. But I bought um, some little glass containers and like little tiny clear beads for my makeup. Uh, I got a, a bunch of new brushes for Christmas, makeup brushes. And um, I need to sort that out because as of right now, it's like an insane amount of brushes. And I can't actually find what I want. So I'm going to like separate them and make them look pretty and I'm excited and then I also went over to Office Depot and got a new notebook because I always feel like when you're having trouble like focusing on something for me colored pens and pretty notebooks always help me to focus so I got a new notebook and I'm gonna use that to write down ideas on what to do for videos for this channel so hopefully that works out well and I also bought a 2015 um, calendar journaly thing so I can like plan out my year. So now I'm going to PetSmart to replace a light bulb for my fish tank. Real exciting stuff guys. But I'm doing really good on time so yay. Here is one of our fish tanks. I call this tank our baby tank because we use this tank as a quarantine 
for all the fish that go into our 55 gallon. This right here is a 10 gallon, I believe. Um, or maybe a 20. I don't remember. But it's a small tank. And these are some rainbow fish that are probably going to be going into the big tank actually really soon. Um, we always quarantine our fish because we've had a few um, that we didn't quarantine. And oh no, there's a dead one right there. Gross. Um, we have a few, we've had a few in the past that go into the big tank and then contaminate all our other fish and kill them. Um, it's actually happened quite a few times, so since then we always quarantine our fish. This is my noisy cat, June, chilling us three legs. This is very cute. Junie, you're very loud. Yes, you are. Anyways, I'm about to change the light bulb in this tank, so for... Boom. You can't really tell. But I really did change the light bulb. See? It's... You can see the reflection of it glowing. So, now I'm going to remove this poor little guy and give him a proper burial. And then go finish my king cake. <laughs> Alright. See you soon. Hey! So, I made it back from um, the store. But I already told you that, so never mind. Um, I finished the king cake. It is now in the oven. Let me just show you. Ooh, wow, it puffed up a bunch. So it's got like a um, mason jar in the middle and then the cake is wrapped around it. And it looks pretty good. Hopefully it turns out. And now I'm just waiting. I also made um, some cookies for my friend for the bonfire. I made some white chocolate. And I, that was a really big close up on my face, I'm sorry. A white chocolate and pistachio um, cookies. So that's just chilling while um, the king cake cooks. Um, I also found out from my friends for the Friendsgiving party that it's gonna be a little bit later than I thought. Um, it starts at two, but we're not eating dinner until like five or six. So I don't need to be over there until closer to that time, which is like a huge relief because I don't no, I don't remember. It's like 2 something. I'm probably like close to 2.30 right now. And I was supposed to be like, my original thought was that I was supposed to be there by 2. So thank God that I didn't, like I have more time because I, I wouldn't have made it. Like this thing still, the king cake still has 16 minutes left. So I definitely wouldn't have made it. So right now, I am actually going to use these. I am going to make a hot sauce. Um, these are from my dad. He grew these. Um, these two are, I think these two are the devil's tongue. These, okay, these are really, really, really spicy peppers. My family, well, my dad, me and Kyle, my sister, all really, really, really love hot peppers. Oh, Kyle's my husband, by the way. Um, so my dad grew these peppers and he sent them to us and it's really hard to Obviously, you don't eat them like this. So we make them into hot sauces. So I think these three are marugas, these two are devil's tongue, and then these two are reapers. I could be completely wrong, and I'm really sorry if I am. But I'm going to make a hot sauce. I'm going to make a sriracha sauce with these. Hey again. So now it is uh, 3 something, probably like 3.30. I know, I'm like really late for this. Well, I'm not late for the party because it doesn't actually start until 6, but like there are people there now if I wanted to go. Um, but good news. I got the king cake done. All I need to do is put the frosting on it. So yay, it looks really good, doesn't it? It looks kind of legit, except for this big hole didn't connect. Oh well. I also finished the um, white chocolate and pistachio cookies. Well, I'm almost done. I have my last batch in there. And then the last thing that I made was a hot sauce, which looks very nasty. Um, I don't, it made a lot less than I thought it was supposed to. It kind of burned a little when I was cooking it. Like you're supposed to cook it to cook off some of the vegetable, the raw vegetable smell it said, but I don't know, it kind of looks like I burnt it. And I mean, not burnt, but like I definitely cooked it too much. Um, yeah. <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to do with it. I, my husband wants, wanted me to make this and um, yeah, I don't know. I have no idea what I'm going to do with it. Uh, I don't have any bottles, I don't think. Hey, nope, I have bottles. I'm going to put it in a bottle, and yeah, we'll see how it tastes. I'm going to try it at the party. So, five minutes left on those white chocolate cookies. I'm going to take those out. 
I'm gonna ice that cake, I'm gonna make the green bean casserole, finally, and then I'm probably gonna head out to the party, so, well, and I also need to bottle up the hot sauce. <sighs> busy, 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 busy day. <laughs> so, I'll check in later. Hey, so, guess what? The king cake's done! Yay! It looks very ugly, unfortunately. I tried a piece. It tastes okay. It tastes okay. It's very, very, very lemony. Because there's lemon in the icing, lemon in the dough, and lemon in the filling. So it's just like, lemon! When you take a bite. But, it's not bad. It's not. Yeah. The frosting is disgusting. But the rest of it's pretty good. So, um, C plus, I give it. Then I also have this Satan sauce. Actually, it's just sriracha. Um, well, it's sriracha made with those super spicy peppers that I was showing y'all. Um, but it didn't make very much because I think I messed it up. But um, we'll give it a shot after I get back from my party. And then this is what I made for the party. It is green bean casserole. And I really wish I would have made more because I realized as I was dumping this into the container that there's going to be close to 20 people there. This isn't going to feed 20 people. I don't know what I was thinking. <sighs> oh well. <laughs> and then I also have fully completed the pistachio white chocolate cookies. So those are all done. And then when I get back from Friendsgiving, I'm going to package those up. I'm going to somehow transport this there. And I'm going to take the hot sauce, some of our other hot sauces, and our super spicy rum. So I will see y'all when I get to Friendsgiving. Bye! <sighs> so guys, it is now the end of the day. I did not film at my Friendsgiving and I didn't film at the bonfire. It just seemed a little bit weird. Um, none of my friends uh, really do the vlogging thing and I just feel like it would have been a little bit awkward to pull out my camera. Um, so, I just enjoyed it. They were really fun. It was a really good time. Um, the king cake that I made did a really weird thing at the bonfire. Um, it kind of melted. Like, when I finished cooking it, it was done on the inside. It wasn't doughy. But when I took it to the bonfire, it started to get, like, doughy in the middle. And, it, and then, as the night progressed, like, right before I left, it was, like, almost completely raw in the middle. And I have no idea why. It was so mm -hmm. weird. Um, but, yeah, so, I don't know, I threw it away, not very, only two people ate it, and they were being polite and said it was nice, because I know that it tasted terrible, but I made these cookies, those, um, pistachio and white chocolate cookies, and everybody loved them, they were gone, completely gone by the end of the night, which is always really good when you make something that a bunch of people eat. Um, my green bean casserole... Not so much. Um, people ate it, but there were a lot of kids at this event, um, and I guess kids don't like green bean casserole. So they didn't really eat that much of it, but that's okay. It, I thought it was tasty, and the food there was very, very good. And yeah, I had a really good time, and now it's very late. It's 11.24, which I know isn't like too, too terribly late, but it's pretty late for me. I don't say I'm very late. I'm a big lame -o. So this is it. This is the end of day one of my first vlog. And actually, it was really fun. It wasn't that hard. I thought that talking to a camera was going to be a lot more difficult than it ended up being. So I don't know. I might, I'm might. i going to try this. I am going to Dallas this weekend, and I'm going to bring you all along. I'm going to go visit my sister. We're going to go to a really cool restaurant called Fireside Pies. Um, we're probably going to do some shopping and hang out in Dallas. And yeah, I'll bring the camera along and vlog and see how that goes because I'd really really love to make some travel vlogs because I travel a lot so that would be really cool if I can get into that so we'll see how it goes thanks for watching I'll see you next time bye